I can't believe people are doing this in Excel. If you are tracking your inventory like this, stop right now. Instead, try this. Go here and enter the filter function. Select the range with the product and the quantity that we want to display. Now let's enter our condition. Select the range with the quantities and input greater than zero so we can display the in-stock items. Enter another filter function here to track the out-of-stock items. This time, select only the products. For the condition, enter that the quantity needs to be equal to zero. Confirm, and that's it. As you can see, everything is dynamic if we change an amount. Not yet you may die, 